In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I made this side table doing an acrylic pour and using epoxy resin. To get this piece of wood as smooth as possible, I started by using 80 grit sandpaper and worked my way up to 320. Now I'm using the resin, I'm just pouring part A and part B equally into the same cup and then mixing them together. So now that the resin is done being mixed, I'm just pouring it into the emerald shade. I think it's like a super dark emerald. Um, but yeah, I'm just pouring it in there and mixing it together and then doing the same for the gold. So now I'm doing the acrylic pour. But here in a second, you'll see me use olive green, but I ended up just covering it with emerald because it didn't look good and it wasn't complemented by the other two colors so yeah spraying alcohol on top to help the color separate. this project on pause for like two days because it was raining like crazy but I am ready to move on with this project um, the table is fully cured now um, it's been sitting for like five four or five days now so I am 100% comfortable with um, sanding over this and just moving on with the project so that is what we're gonna be doing today So now I'm just pouring the epoxy evenly all over the tabletop. Uh, this is very important to make sure that you let it dry on a level uh, table. This right here is not level at all. Like it's literally just a piece of wood on top of salt horses. So I'm just going to quickly uh, spread it out evenly and then take it inside to an even table. Now I'm just using a hairdryer to get out any air bubbles. Most people will use a torch or a heat gun, but since I don't have either of those, I'm just working with what I have. <laughs> 